All right, I'm just going to skip the intro and just head straight over here. Just make it as quick as possible for you guys. You guys clicked on the video for a reason. Um, head over to pixlr.com, link in the description. I'll leave that there for you guys. We're going to head over to the advanced photo editor this time. Last video I did um, with the thumbnail, I did it with the simple editor. So we, we're over here. Um, scroll down all the way. And you're going to see YouTube art. That's pretty much where your banners are. Now, I already have a photo saved for this. I picked this template, I just liked it, so, you know, the green color. But I forgot to mention, actually, when you head over, make sure that the, right here, you'll see these crowns. Make sure that the crowns are not in the way of whatever you're selecting, unless you want to pay money to get that premium membership. So I chose this free one right here, so we're going to click here. So what we're going to be doing right here, we're just going to remove this background image. It should be all the way at the bottom. So we just remove that all we have to do is you know go on google look up whatever it is or if you have a photo already saved in this case we're doing a gaming channel banner so we chose something gaming related apex legends was something i chose i play that a lot personally so um we're gonna head back over here you're going to click on this show and folder or in this case if you can't you can always hit file open image it'll take you same place so we're just gonna drag this in here um click on add current and you're just going to drag this to the right proportion of your screen so it doesn't need to be perfect resolution i'll show you why right now because you want to click on your screen and hit filter details blur now this pretty much gives you a really cool effect it doesn't overwhelm the eyes because you know you're gonna have text over here and you don't want to overwhelm the text with the image too so keep it simple we're gonna keep it at 62 now drag it make sure it's all the way at the bottom because if it's not at the bottom you know you're just gonna get little minor mistakes so always remember it's just at the bottom unless you can't have it at the bottom you know you could always do that but for this for this template we're doing at the very bottom so now we're just left with the text, which is really simple. All you have to do is just double click on this. I go by Eric on YouTube, so we'll just go right here. And then same with this other one. Okay, I guess it's all caps in this font, so that's fine. We'll just all caps is okay. So let's say, you know, I have a website or you just don't want it. If you don't want it, you can always just backspace it, click off of it, or even just delete it. Press the little delete button right there on your keyboard. But let's say you have a you have a website, so you know, for example, Eric.com, right? I got a little website. So this is pretty much your thumbnail. It's really simple. You're pretty much pretty much done with the actually I forgot to do this part. So the image is done. All you need to do is click file save um you can make it whatever works for you me i'll keep it at the recommended settings at 100 percent quality click save as we'll put youtube banner. so we'll have youtube banner up on there and then the file saved that's it so if you guys are interested in gaming live streams and just anything like that i do post those I do stream pretty frequently, so if you guys are into that, be sure to subscribe and leave the bell notification on so you'll be notified whenever I do stream. Um, I'm not really good at the game, as you can see right here, I just got popped with a sniper rifle somehow. But yeah, that's going to be it for the video, I hope you guys did enjoy. And if you have any questions, I'll get back to that as soon as I can, and I'll see you guys for another video.